A big development has emerged in a case of alleged sexual assault against the Bishop of Jalandhar, Franco Mulakkal. An audio tape has now emerged that is purportedly of a conversation between a priest affiliated uh, to known to the bishop and a nun who is supporting the victim. Now, the audio, if true, shows an attempt to try and silence the victim, who is also a nun. While the bishop is part of the Jalandhar Church, the incident took place in Kotayam in Kerala a few weeks ago. Absolutely true. Uh, this is uh, this particular 11-minute audio clip, audio conversation between the senior priest and uh, a nun, Anupama. Anupama is one of the uh, you know nuns, six nuns who has supported uh, uh, the 44-year-old nun, uh, you know, in the Kuruvilangat convent, who has supported, uh, who has uh, you know, who has been allegedly uh, raped uh, by the bishop uh, between 2014 and 2016 multiple times. A case has been registered against the bishop, uh, and also a statement has been taken. Uh, in this regard. Now, right. uh, the man uh, alleged to be uh, a senior priest, in this case, Father James, hmm. you can hear him saying to influence the nun who is supporting the complaint, and the man offers land, hmm. that is 10 acres of land, and convent for the nun if she withdraws the complaint. The person is also heard saying that he has taken this initiative under the influence uh, uh, of nun, but uh, he also says that you know he can do whatever possible within his ambit uh, in the provided time. Uh, it's all, he also said that, you know, it, if at all the, the, these nuns, you know, go back uh, to any other diocese in uh, Orissa or Hyderabad or any other part of the country, they will be targeted. And also, uh, they, they, will, they will be stigmatized at any point of time. So it's be, it'll be, be better if you withdraw the complaint. Right. So it's asking him politely uh, everything. But you can also hear, uh, you know, nun Anupama clearly refusing, saying that we have certain city, uh, we have taken up this, and we have ne never decided to come back uh, on this particular case. Right. Uh, there's there's a veiled threat, there's intimidation, and there is, of course, like you said, trying to lure with uh, land and cash, trying to silence the supporter of the victim. Uh, we have more breaking inputs coming in.
Now, the police team probing the complaint against the, the Jalandhar Bishop, Franco Mulakkal, has recorded the statement of the nun. Now, according to the Kota Yam police, a case will be registered based on the statement of the nun. Right, so that's uh, important information that we're breaking to our viewers here, Vivek, because uh, this is going to have tremendous significance, the statement of the nun that has been recorded by the police. Uh, can you tell us what is the status of investigation and after the leak of that audio tape, uh, what repercussions has it had really in, into the probe? I see this this uh, particular 11 minute audio clip was actually released yesterday uh, but it was under the custody of a you know a media house but they haven't given it to anyone but it was yesterday evening uh, that it, you know uh, even we got uh, to this particular 11 minute audio clip yes. and after the clip was released uh, the Porte MSP uh, uh, Hari Shankar and his team has taken the statement of uh, none hmm. uh, uh, after coming to this particular uh, convent uh, in hmm. Kurovicad and then uh, what he said was the case will be registered based on the statement of the nun on Monday. Since it's a non-cognizable offence, the case could be registered only with the permission of the court. Now, we know uh, the whole tra uh, trouble for this particular Bishop Mulekel, uh, you know, uh, in the case, you know, in June, uh, when the nun alleged that she was sexually abused uh, by him several times between 2014 and 16, an FIR has been registered, an 114-page statement was also taken by the police. Twice the statement was taken uh, by the police, and and the police right. clearly said that the nun has repeated the, the same offence. Uh, you know, in the in both the statements. Uh, you know, we, uh, at one point of time there was also, you know, there was uh, you know the, uh, the the cops were also saying that they could arrest this particular bishop, but then uh, what we understand is that you know uh, the, the, uh, due to some political pressure, uh, this particular bishop was not arrested, and uh, now the cops are saying that you know they they could go to jail right. at any point of time and question him. Right. Uh, thanks, Vivek. Uh, stay with us, Vivek, because we've got some more news from Kerala.